Hello guys, it's me Carl Santos, aka Apricar95, and I have some breaking news from the Hendrick Motorsports camp. And I want to say that Rick Hendrick has masked an offer for his sponsor, HendrickCars.com, to be on Kyle Larson's hood for the next two years. So that means 35 races, plus Valvoline and Nathan Garden. They might hang around, and I was just watching a YouTube video a few minutes ago regarding how Eric Eastip was giving praise to Kyle Larson and he said the key word rewarding talent over getting funding or having enough money to get sponsors on your car you know to market yourself and all that and I think he hit the nail on the head you know there's not enough talented drivers that qualify as far as getting funding at the same time because, you know, there's some that are too shy. There's some that are too, um, I mean, have too much ego or arrogance, you know, like you have to put the right image to a, a Fortune 500 company, I say, in order to land a top cup ride, you know, and. Some of them have that, and some of them don't, you know. Look at Kyle Busch. He has M&M's, for examples, and M&M's has gone up and down on his uh, image because he's wrecked drivers on purpose, like Ron Hornet, for example, you know. like. And then they had to suspend him two cup races in 2011, and then they said, hang in there, Rowdy. I know you aren't doing a one-off for a truck race, but I don't, if you do that one more time to any of your competitors, your contract will be terminated, and that's what Kyle Larson doesn't want to do ever again, you know, with this second, second chance, you know, like, you have to take care of all your sponsors and make them exposed or so forth, because... It's not an easy sport to hang around for 20 years and, and many race fans, you know, like, they don't have that much interest or, or even the firepower to want to watch for four hours on every Sunday, so. And I have one more thing before I leave to watch the NASCAR Weekly Podcast, so. I was watching a um, an art like a video off of YouTube a few minutes ago regarding Eric Eastip's part about how Kyle Larson was rewarded talent, you know, and how he just was able to, you know, get rewarded with a two year ex not extension but a two year contract to stay in Hendrick until 2023 I believe so I'm gonna show you the YouTube video from Eric Eastup's YouTube channel so don't go away later this month but still not even 30 yet he's got many years of winning ahead of him and speaking of winning that's my big takeaway from this whole thing you know it's cool to see you know Hendrick cars.com saying oh we've seen an uptick in traffic our sponsorship has been worth it it's cool to see them stepping up in a big way just to support Hendrick Motorsports support a major NASCAR team it's great in all those ways of course but at the core of the news today is that a major sponsor is rewarding a NASCAR driver for his on-track success so we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content. And if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You'll have a great day and peace out.